in junior high school, I took home ec. And, you know, they said, oh, home ec will never pay off. Well, I, I sew all sorts of things. You know, I never thought I would sew. And, you know, I, I sew all the time. I didn't find anything really difficult. Uh, it all came pretty natural. Because, um, you know, going through high school, I always took shop classes and, uh, you know, mechanics and stuff. So, pretty good with my hands. And so everything was just, you know, just adapting. You know, whether it's, you know, sewing on the big sole stitcher over here or grinding, um, you know, tearing things apart. You know, it's just, it's all hand work. It's amazing because I have customers come in that go to a garage sale, buy a pair of boots for a quarter, and they'll come in and put $75, $80 in there rebuilding the boots and because they can't find another pair like them in the world. You know, they're going, I can, you know, there's no way I can replace this. And, you know, there's a number of shoes that I wish I would have kept going longer. I had uh, a pair of shoes that I loved. So I went and bought three more pair because I knew that that's, as soon as you like a shoe, mm -hmm. it's going to go out of style. And so when you like something, you go get a couple of pairs yeah, of them. And the first couple pair, uh, you know, I used them, edges. threw them away. I may have, you know, put like heels on them a couple times and then, I don't know. And then the last one, I tried to really keep going. And by the time I was done with that, I was going, oh man, <laughs> I should have kept the other ones going too. And uh, so, you know, it's, uh, it's one of those things where you you, uh, you try to hold on to things uh, because, you know, they're comfortable and, you know, you know unless the shoe is just destroyed, we don't turn it away.